for skipping several summons from the IGG, the inspectorate swung into action and arrested former Uganda Airlines Chief Executive Officer Conwell Mlea from his home. He was picked up and taken to record a statement. Mr. Conwell Mlea has been arrested and, uh, and charged with the offense of failure to attend before the Inspectorate of Government when so ordered. So this is therefore to pass a message to members of the public against disobeying the Inspectorate of Government orders. The move comes over a year after directive from the President, instructing Works and Transport Minister General Edward Katumba Wamala to suspend him from work, along with 12 other officials, on April 21st, 2021. The three-month suspension was called to pave way for investigations into allegations of financial mismanagement, corrosion and nepotism in staff recruitment, among other issues. In July, the president issued another directive to have Malay and 12 officers be interdicted. And during the term of his office, there were irregularities discovered about his style of management of the company, and a complaint was filed here about a year or so ago which the, the Inspectorate of Government has been investigating over time. So it is on the basis of that that we summoned him, being the CEO, the Chief Executive Officer of the National Airline, former. Mulea Zambian Nation, who managed the airline between 2019 and April 2021, will tomorrow be arraigned before court. By April 2022, government had invested over 2 trillion shillings in the airline, leading to the purchase of six aircraft, among other assets. Meanwhile, the IGG says she will investigate the alleged 40 million shillings shared by each MP, especially if evidence is adduced that it was obtained outside the law. We don't have better and further particulars, and uh, I cannot divulge into that also unless I'm given details of the matter, but it would be nice for us to interest ourselves in it as the Inspectorate of Government and investigate it and find out if it is true that they were paid, what was the purpose of the payment? Hubbard Ziwa, NTV.